LeBron versus Tom Brady in relation to our newly elected 45th president of the United States, Donald Trump. Now, you must understand, LeBron resonates with the working middle class community because of where he comes from. And because, of course, as you all said, he is inspirational from a basketball perspective as well as a cultural perspective. Now, where does he come from? LeBron, high school graduate, of course he did go straight to the NBA, most high school graduates do not do that, but he's not formally college educated, as well as his mother had him at 16 years old, single mom, disenfranchised community, so he had to work for everything he got, which was becoming one of the best basketball players in the NBA at this current time, and having uh, millions of dollars, being a multi-million dollar athlete with many endorsements, as well as hundred million dollar contracts and all that good stuff, so He's going to potentially endorse someone such as Hillary Clinton because he understands the background of many of the people who may have voted for her. Now, Tom Brady, who voted for clearly uh, Donald Trump because him and Bill, he and Bill Check did say that they both have a personal relationship, so they did have to extend their congratulations. Now, let's not forget Tom Brady did say before that he wants to get into politics. Let's look at Tom Brady's resume, which he has posted before. He's college educated. He understands political science. He went to the University of Michigan. He graduated. He's now a, a great quarterback, multi-million dollar athlete. And he's also someone who has now a friend in the White House. Donald Trump has opened that door for him to get into politics. And he's got plenty of money. Now, the thing that I question here, Donald Trump's character was considered pretty questionable at times during the election. Now... Isn't it ironic that birds of a feather may flock together, considering Mr. Tom Brady himself uh, was also a person who participated in the Deflategate scandal, as well as Spygate.